All right. Okay, so. Hi. So, here in the slider, right? So, what you want to do is add up um, text here with the background, and the background you want it to be see through or somewhat see through, right? So, you add the layer, text layer, and we say uh, big. Uh, red see through box all right okay so after you have that here you can choose here you can choose a, a style template that's what you've been doing right so here these are predefined so you cannot change these ones see like that one that's that's what you are going to get right so if you want something that is not here already predefined uh, you have to do it yourself, so um, you can change the, the font so I choose this one um, the font size, let's make it 48 48 the line height see what is happening here, the background is clipping into the text is because of the line height is only 22 so the line height line height needs to be at least the same as the font um, size so we're gonna go with 48 right see now the box around it is is proportion um so to make the background right so here is already white because here you can change the, the the color but you already know that um, and here this one you can change the the if it is uh, thin like 300 or bold like 900 right see so you got bold now okay and to do the background you have to click this one right here advanced style on and off and that's uh, the big secret so you click that one and now here you have see you got font you got background okay so now in the background you choose a color so let's say red okay red because it's supposed to be a big red and then on this one right here it says background opacity and it's set to one so the way it works is from zero to one uh, zero means all the way see through means like no there is no background and one will be all the way through so if you want to make it see through you probably want to go with 0 0.5 which you will be like 50% see through. See, now it's see through. I don't like it. It's too, way too low, so maybe it works kind of similar to Photoshop. So now it's a uh, 80% basically, right? So now it's a little bit more. Um, so it's see through as you can see there. Um, yeah, no, let's play. Let's make it 70. Okay, there. And then now you can see that the the background is pretty close or surrounding the the text so what you want to do is add some padding like here like you have padding so i would say 10 points 10 pixels now here padding left 10 no padding top 10 pixels padding right about 30 pixels which padding is this one this one has to be low so this is 10 pixels and party left is gonna be 30 pixels and there there is your box ready to go and I believe you can save it but I'm not sure what happens if you click it here oh there you go so after you have this done right and you like and you go, you think you're gonna use this this uh, particular style uh, often you can just click this one save save as and you can type it for example big red c true box and save Ta -da. see now now it's selected so now every time you're gonna do a new one you just select that one anything and i hope this can help 
if you have any more questions just let me know okay bye